All right, so today's video is going to be a bit different than my typical trend analysis breakdown videos. I want to give Google a huge shout out for sponsoring this video. The other day I was checking my packages and received this. Let's open up this envelope. Really great packaging. Okay, what do we got here? Step up to the challenge, the Google workshop, Los Angeles, California. Are you in? Ooh. I'm definitely in, I'm definitely ready to do this. I'm excited to share this with you guys, but actually, let's go to LA. Today is the day we finally get to see what Google has planned for us. Let's go see. We just got access to this experience. This is insane. I'm seeing some very familiar names here. Love Elliot's videos. This is our spot right here. Gotta check it out, right? I mean, that's a no brainer. <laughs> what has Google done? This is literally my setup that we have back home. The vibes for anime are on point, as you can see. Gotta have a little mirror for the fits. Absolute must. Japanese art, anime, mangas, different things of that nature. And then, of course, you have to have the desk set up. It's decked out in a very Drew Joyner-ish fashion. I know that there's this console, this, this portal over here. It says, Welcome, Drew. Are you ready for your challenge? Oh, gosh. OK, yeah, I think I'm ready choose three different Adidas shoes to wear for a whole year. I can get down with that. I love Adidas. <laughs> Oof. And then nine different ways to style them. That's an actual challenge. We have a Pixel phone here. We're going to shop these looks and these shoes using Google. Let's do shop Adidas shoes. One of the cool things that not a lot of people know about, something I've recently discovered myself, is you're able to kind of filter through the products and the items that you really want to curate for a particular shopping session, right? And so for me, obviously, I'm looking for menswear shoes. I think I'm going to go for black shoes. You can find a ton of different black options in Adidas. You know, the classic hit maker, they have tons of really cool black shoes. Looks like we have a good pair of superstars here. I think it would be an absolute gym to have four outfits that I need to be styling, especially if, when it comes to longevity and, and, and those kind of pieces, right? It makes it super easy to order something when you get the full information like this. So let's go ahead and add it to the cart. I think it would also be a lot of fun to kind of add a bit more color. We're heading into spring. As weather gets warmer, you kind of want to show a bit of pop of color. So we're going to do men's again, of course. Green. Let's do something like lace up. Something about the Adidas Gazelle is, is speaking to me. The, the hue of green that's a part of this particular model, as well as just the kind of silhouette, is really, really gorgeous to me. Add to the cart. For this last particular item of footwear, let's crank up the color just a bit more and take it back to a particular model that I've loved for a long time. I would honestly argue and say that this shoe has maybe even been integral in terms of getting me into fashion when it was first introduced. We're talking about the Ultra Boost. In terms of comfort alone, probably the most comfortable item that I've ever put on my foot. This is going to bring a ton of color, going to bring a lot of attention to your feet. And I, I like that for these. I like that a lot for these, especially with all the other features that you get with the Ultra Boost, right? Go ahead and add these to the cart. Make sure they have our size. Add to bag, add to cart, whatever your choice is, and we're rolling. All right, so we have all of our sneakers for this particular challenge. I think we have a good crop of shoes. Let's go do this challenge. We got some sneakers on the desk. Those are the sneakers that we just ordered. It looks like we have a little bit of clothes to play with as well. Almost like we're back at home making videos in the uh, good old studio space. I love a crispy pair of kicks. And obviously with the Adidas Superstar, like I mentioned before, you're getting those subtle details of the Superstar logoing. I know that these are going to hold up for a good period of time. These are a great pair of shoes, something that I envision wearing a ton 
in the upcoming months, spring or summer, they are perfect. <laughs> <laughs> These are gonna be the gazelles. Getting a particular item of four in hand really puts into context the true colors. This one has like a tiny hint or tint of cream. Love the suede on here as well. Kind of a mid-nap level of suede on this one. These are gonna create a particular style of outfit. These are gonna create a different style, but also equally as fun and as exciting. Last but not least, Adidas Ultra Boost. These are unbelievably bright. I love the fact that it has end plastic waste on the actual insole, kind of just giving a little bit of initial impressions for the outfits for each of these. It would be great to pair these with something that has like a black pair of trousers or a dark fitting pair of trousers, and then you can kind of work the outfit from up in there. But I think these two in particular will play to that more like uplifting spring kind of vibe, especially the gazelle. It's a casual shoe for sure, but it can be elevated as well. You have to love that versatility. That's why this is such an iconic pair of shoes. With the Ultra Boost, they have so much gravity around them. They pull you into them in terms of like their design language. And obviously th the color is so bright that I think that there will be a lot of items and different things that I'll be able to play with. I'm excited for this challenge. This has been a lot of fun so far. So if you know my channel, this is definitely what I call a fitty fit. For this outfit, we have a pair of darker tan trousers, kind of more straight fitting, a little bit above the sneaker so you can see everything. And for this occasion, I wanted to throw on a vest with the Oxford collar. This is more like hanging out, going to meet friends. For a little bit of just pizzazz, something fun, had to throw this checkered beanie in. And then, if your friends are some cool cats like mine are, gotta throw the sunglasses on, you know what I'm saying? No one knows where you're looking at, no one knows your moves. That could be a good thing or a bad thing, but I, I really, really enjoy this outfit 100%. So this is a super fun way to elevate the gazelles. For this outfit, I was kind of going for backyard, kind of wedding kind of feel. I really enjoy this outfit a lot especially the way that the black pants kind of flow into the gazelles and let them kind of speak for themselves. This one is a lot of fun. This might be one of my favorite outfits that we created for this challenge. The continuity of the black pants sitting to the black superstars, and then we have the pink beanie that kind of matches with the side bag, like some of the hits of the side bag is golden. And, and for this look, I think I'm going some sort of cafe, getting some work done, grabbing some coffee, making sure that everything I have is what I need in my bag. And this one is stellar for sure. This is a fantastic outfit that shows the examples of how you can layer colorfully with something like the Adidas Superstar and let the outfit kind of showcase the majority of what you're looking for in terms of just being the main focal point and then letting the superstars kind of be a more subtle piece in that outfit. And I absolutely love this one. I would go to a game of some sort with this one on with the side bag, bring my camera, you're good to go. You have everything you need. So yeah, I really enjoy this outfit. So for this outfit, we have the gazelles paired up with a bit more of a kind of elevated casual look. This one's kind of giving me first date vibes. Like, hello, nice to meet you, how are you doing? But I think even adding an extra touch, if it's outside, if it's sunny, you know what I'm saying? Grab sunglasses. I think you look really, really smooth right now, Drew. <laughs> this outfit is so much Fun. We're going on a picnic day. We're going to the beach. We got everything we need in the bag that we have. And it's just, it screams flower boy, like spring. The weather's changing and everything just feels right. Everything is right in the world, right? There's no issues. Throw on the shades and then you're in another planet right here. Is This is, the vibes on this one are immaculate. The gazelles match the energy perfectly. Socks go with everything. It's colorful, it's fun. For this outfit, we went a bit more cozy, casual. We're letting the Ultra Boost speak for themselves and be the loudest element of the outfit. Pop a color with the beanie. We have our tote bag because we're headed to the grocery store. We're gonna grab some food. We're gonna make dinner later. We're gonna grab some extra snacks, those kind of things. It's just fun, it's relaxed, and I definitely can feel the comfort of these Ultra Boosts. 
you can probably guess where this outfit is going to be in, right? I'm going to the gym, got my gym bag with me, got the shoes I've always dreamed of having at the gym with me, and we're good to go. I absolutely love this outfit for this challenge in particular. These are definitely a pair of shoes that I'll be able to wear all year long. For me, when I go to the airport or when I'm traveling of any sort, I love to have an outfit that reflects kind of something that's a bit more comfortable. Obviously, with the Ultra Boost, you're gonna have comfort, and that's perfect for this challenge. This is like the comfort shoe of the occasions. I also love the layering that's implemented within this outfit. For me, like the fact that I can have a little bit of pop of color to show that, you know, it's springtime, like we still having fun after this flight. This one is really, really nice. And I think it's a perfect capstone for the challenge. So for this outfit, I love the fact that I can play with the color green and the tone of green in so many different ways. From the green of the gazelles to the actual pants to the jacket, and then you have the pop of color coming out through the bottom layer of this outfit and then the sunglasses. It's something that I see myself wearing on multiple occasions from a concert potentially and then taking off the jacket if it gets a little bit too warm or even maybe something like a cool like second or third day, something like that. This is one of my favorite fits for the challenge without a doubt. I love this outfit and in it, and its whole entirety, I love it. This was such a fun experience. Creating the nine outfits that we did with the three shoes that we selected, I think we did a pretty good job. It kind of reflects my personal style. Let's go out to the shopping hub and see if the workshop says our challenge is completed. That's a very, very good sign. It looks like we completed the challenge, which means let's go. I'm super excited about that. I want to give a huge thank you to Google for curating everything about this experience, about this workshop. And I also want to give a huge shout out to Adidas for providing the footwear. It was a blast, guys. Peace.